For seven weeks, investigators say a missing 17-year-old girl was hiding inside a Rockford home. She's now safe, but at this point in the investigation, no criminal charges have been filed. And across the street, as I stopped at the stop sign, I saw a girl with her bike. And she was crouched down, like, putting stuff in this little bike trailer. After weeks of no sightings on Sunday, 17-year-old Penelope Wise was found packing up a bicycle in front of this Rockford home. We opened the window and my mom was like, hey, honey, are you okay? And she kind of peeked her head over. She's like, yeah, I'm good. And I was like, do you need help? And she's like, no, no, I'm fine. And I knew it was her. Hours after leaving her Cedar Springs home on May 31st. We've been following the case online. We've been looking at her picture. We've been thinking about Penny. Investigators say the teenager met a 43-year-old man. I know not everybody believes in God, but I really believe that he put us in the right place at the right time to see her and that she looked up and that I recognized her. I think it was divine. We're told the two stayed together in his home for the entire seven weeks she was missing. It is really sad that she was there the whole time. But what happens now? You'd think there'd be some sort of law that would prevent this, but we looked at it. Kent County Prosecutor Chris Becker says Penny's age makes issuing criminal charges in the case impossible. Whether it be harboring a runaway, contributing to the delinquency of a minor, or even custodial interference, none of those applied. If she was 16, it would be a different situation. It's clearly troubling, but we can't just charge things because we find they're troubling. We have to follow the law, and, and that's what we did. The sheriff's office tells me at this point they believe they have filled out the entire timeline from when Penny went missing till the moment she was found, but they will never turn away any potential tips. So if you believe that you may have info that could be helpful to this case, call the sheriff's office or Silent Observer. In the studio, Michael Martin, Fox 17 News.